Number five. First up we have Vixie. Vixie can be assigned to a ranch to produce pal spheres and arrows. This pal is especially useful for beginners. Vixie can be found on the southern side of the map near the starting area. Number four. Next up we have Flambell. Flambell can also be assigned to a ranch to produce flame organs which are useful for crafting flame arrows and forges. This pal can also be hard to find but it spawns in the northeast and southwest parts of the map. An easier way to find Flambell is to complete a hideout with a caged pal. Number three. For number three we have Bushi. Bushi has level three in logging which also allows him to chop trees without a farm. He also has a level 2 forging which allows him to cook ingots fast. Bushi has level 2 transporting to help him move items around the base. Not only is Bushi good ar around the base, but he also makes great combat pal as well. You can find Bushi in the southwestern part of the map, or you can find him as an alpha pal at the center continent. Number 2. For number 2 we have Catrus. Catrus has level 2 handicraft. This makes her useful for crafting any items you need. She also has level 2 medicine, which is quite useful for making medicine for all your pal sick pals. Catrus is also a great pal. You can find her at night in the northern part of the map. Also, you can find her as an alpha pal on the southern part of the map. Number one. For number one spot, I chose Pen King. He has level two cooling to keep your food fresh, level two transporting to collect your food. He has level two watering to help grow your food, and he has level two mining for farming stone and ore, and he has handicraft for helping you make items. Pen King makes a great pal for combat. He has an ice slide move that freezes enemies solid. You can find Pen King on the southern part of the map, and you can find him as an alpha pat near the sealed realm with frozen wings. Thanks for watching everyone, don't forget to like and subscribe.